week students unique preparation method for math let me point out some facts which will be more beneficial for proper preparation of math this discussion is completely aimed on the preparation methodology for the students who are weak in quants here i want to uh, mention some most common uh, factors or you can say that uh, obstacles which incur to weak students and i will point out how to overcome it and i have a world of hope that if you will pay sincere attention your problem will be reduced to a great extent so let us move further there are two major problems with weak students first weak students unable to interpret a question i have seen many students who find themselves helpless to decide what to do when they came across a math quants it's a very common facts with laborious but weak students they do lot of practice but in exam hall they find them quite helpless to follow the correct steps while solving the quant or any math question and second one is that is the another problem is to slow calculation a bit lot of mistake in calculation particularly with fraction and equation if you feel the same problems are with you watch this video very carefully because you will find the basic reasons of your problem and you will know how to overcome these hindrances here i want to point out an universal fact whenever our brain faces some question it tries to relate the problem with the past experience it happens with everyone with a weak or genius students if your brain able to relate distinctly with the past experience it solves the problem very fast or guide you proper way to get the answer but if your brain don't have any vivid picture uh, which is related to that question or problem your confusion starts accordingly and if you don't have any related experience perception or picture whatever you will say you simply surrender to that problem and if and uh, you may point out to me that it happens with everyone yes you are 100% right but problem of weak student is slightly different after many trials by that weak student their perception or experience or mental picture never form to that extent to that mark and again it remains for a short while or short period you just keep one thing in mind that for weak students some separate activities should be should be must be done to create vivid and long lasting picture to their brain so that they can relate the things same way as a sharp in math does i have done this in a different way and i get instant result i have also pointed out the slow calculation speed with most of the weak students in the math and this slow speed slow down their courage and confidence and for this reason one must take proper care simultaneously otherwise you won't get the desired result now let us discuss how to start or initiate study strategy to get the maximum benefit for weak students according to me a regular math student is a concept oriented while a weak student likes operation oriented uh, numerical study again i want to uh, say that a regular math student i mean a good math student 
is a concept oriented while a weak student in math is a operation oriented it means a regular math student takes more interest in learning why he has to do a particular step but a weak student seldom takes such interest in why he will do a particular step or particular action a weak student is more interested in knowing what he will have to do to resolve a sum. So I can say there is a tug of war between why to do and what to do. We teacher or professor takes more pain to clear the concept means why to do when a weak in math only wants to know what to do. Therefore, to get success with weak student, we professor will have to change our teaching style. We should take more pain to show what to do while teaching a weak student instead of why to do. So, if you are a weak student, try to know what to do rather why to do. But a math chapter always contains 20 to 30 types of math and every math has its own typical solving root map. Through trial and error, I have found that grouping the entire chapter on the basis of mathematical operation and further regrouping the group in types, in typewise, is an excellent method for a weak student because grouping the chapter mathematical operation wise makes the thing more easy for a weak student because he become able to learn what course of action should be taken and where and thus he also become able to solve the question as a like a good student in math though the perception of good and weak student differs but outcome is the same so my advice to all weak student in math before starting or initiating a math chapter group the entire chapter in action wise and then again uh, every group go for the type wise and to do so naturally you require an able professor who have a clear perception over the entire chapter. To summarize the content, what I have mentioned, I will divide the entire issue under three headlines. First one, classifying every math chapter into group, then in types based on what to do. Through such grouping, whenever a weak student came across a question, through such classification, instantly able to relate what to do. Mind it, in earlier case, this part was missing with weak student. Second one, recapitulation method. This scientific passive revision process makes a weak student to visualize the entire content whatever he had learned. Now the third fast calculation methodology just to find what to do coming across a question and solving the same fastest fast way both are the completely two different issues. If you know what to do, never means you can solve the math fastest, fast way. And if a weak student can't solve a quant question fast way, he will never gain confidence over that math, nor he can face any competition. I never believe that fast calculation skill develops through thinking or doing lot of sum. To get speed for solving math only can be achieved through well-planned scientific 
module. Since time is passing fast, now I have little time. I will discuss uh, this issue, I mean fast calculation methodology later on. So for weak student, I have earnest request to them. One, try to emphasize more on what to do, not on why to do. And do classification of entire chapter, first in groups, then in types, with the help of experienced teacher. Don't try to do yourself because you don't have idea about the uh, uh, idea of the actions. Second, use recapitulation passive revision method to keep the all learned material always fresh. Third one, use scientific fast calculation tools or modules. Avoid Vedic or shortcut methods of fast calculation because they work only on some particular case or situation. So put more emphasis on whatever we have learned in our early days. Further, I want to mention that, uh, that I have started a online class especially for the weak students who want to face SSC, CGL or CHSL exam, bank exam, railway exam, defense exam and uh, this type of exam where due to their inability of uh, doing some fast, they feel they themselves helpless. So my this uh, online class is only uh, that is the only for those students. This online class have some uh, criteria. Let me uh, tell you. Number one is it's an online class. So wherever you are with the help of your smartphone you can do the class. The second one, this class operates from 6 o'clock morn to right, uh, 12 o'clock night. So whenever you will get free time, you can join the class. Third one, the aim of this class is to make a student fast and intelligent over on math so wherever whatever the level you have we are not concerned with fourth one this class is developed or made with the aim to able you people to face the competition But one thing is uh, here, uh, uh, there is one condition you can say, whoever who whoever want to join this class, they must have a, uh, two hours, free hours, so that they can utilize this these two hours every day for the class. This is must. If you don't have that much of time, please don't join this class. As we have discussed, in this class, first we uh, classify the entire chapter mathematical operation wise. We elaborately uh, show the operations through video support. After that, you will have to do homework through WhatsApp group. For the fast calculation, we use so many scientific calculation tools to make your calculation fastest fast. We are starting this class from the 1st January 2017. Already one group is going on. And the charges with discount is only 1000 rupees. But don't think that this is a, a charge for the all groups. This is the charge for the class which is going to commence from the 1st January 2017. And naturally the 
next class which will start from the 15th jan 2017 the charges will be different because the discount part will be again less so if you feel if you desire now you will get a um, our email id just you communicate with us through this email id and we can only say that if you join this class you can reshape your future okay then thank you